Okie dokie, hello there you beautiful you and welcome to more um, Graveyard Keeper. I am I I'm just exploring around a little bit. There's some things that I need to check and you're gonna go along for me with the adventure. The zombie named Gunter told me that there was like some of his brothers that was, you know, under the rubble or something that was somewhere in the witch hill or something or other. Maybe here, maybe there. I, I'm not sure. They had zombie gear somehow, somewhat. I don't. I don't remember. Yeah. Anyway, I, I don't think I'm gonna find anything there. I don't I'm waiting on the donkey. I placed like 30, 30 carrots for them. So it's, it's gonna keep bringing in bodies over and over, nonstop. As I said, here he comes. There's nothing else I can see here. Unless it's like in a super secret location that I can't find it just yet. Which I doubt. In any case, we're gonna go to the dungeon anyways, talk to Gunther and blah blah blah. Okay, everyone, we are now at the cusp of the dungeon. It co it's called the Sacrifice Zone, and it has a quality to it. I can improve the quality by adding skulls to the walls and whatever, but the, po the thing is, I don't know what that changes for me. I don't know what that does. So I'm just going to get in. Oh, cool. So 15 levels. Very nice. All right, here we go. This is all new. I do not know where I am, do not know what's going on. I'm just put the health potions in here. Well, let's find out. Break everything. Metal scrap. Break everything. Ooh. Oh, that's awesome. You can get resources down here. Yeah, we like resources. Wheat seed. Okay. Just gotta be careful not to do too much. Nor too little. No mini map, by the way. Ooh, a high quality pumpkin seed. Well, if I knew that that was a thing, I, I would have come here a long time ago. Okay, so far so easy. I am, however, expecting for that to change very, very rapidly. Oh, but. Heal potion. Oh, okay. Never mind. We have heal potions that we can find in here. Oh, but that's for health only, not energy. Yeah. Okay. Sure. One has to do what one has to do. Okay, so the guy asked me for, like, two buckets of blood. I sincerely don't know where to do that. I thought that maybe here at the dungeon is where I would find that. I mean, they are filling my inventory with a lot of stuff. That's good, at least. Whoa. That was dirty. I didn't know, I didn't know he could do that. That's kind of dirty. Okay, uh, just eat the rest of this. Drink one potion, that's more than enough. Enter. If I enter, can I come back? Ah, uh, all, wait, all of them? <clears throat> okay, it's gonna be one of those, huh? Alright, cool. And hopefully, that's level 2 is gonna be unlocked from now on. Oh, there we go. Nice. But I don't want to be here right now, though. So I'm going to break that, go back, and we're just going to... Oh, and we're back. Oh, and it's the day for, for that guy. Okay. Collect a bucket of blood. Five bloody nails from the dungeon. How do we collect that? Is that, like, just random chance? It's like, look how much metal scrap I got. I got that much metal scrap. Got all of this stuff, but I have yet to see a singular bucket of blood coming from the coming from the dungeon in any capacity. 
Anyway, what did I get? Gonna... This needs to stay here to make paper, I guess. Anyway, I'm gonna organize inventory and I'm gonna go do my mortician stuff and I'll be back when I get more information for you. Okay, so here is the path that is behind the church that this zombie Gunter told me about. There must be the place that Gunter talked about. I think I need to clear rocks, yes. What do I need for that? Okay, so simple iron parts and wood wedge. Okay. All right, here we go. Clear the path. Okay. Should start looking for that zombie. Oh, okay. Now I can rummage. Oh, I see. More like a mummy. Okay, create start building sawmill. You've unlocked the new technology. Okay, so there he is. Oh, I can bring him with me. Oh. Right, well. I'm just gonna toss him somewhere in my morgue and I'll I'll deal with him later, I guess. Uh, what do we do? Can I toss you there? No. Okay, but he is not like a one of those creatures that just stop functioning or like lose durability but now I have uh, myself a technically not animated at all zombie or maybe it only animates itself once I, I don't know, apply some reanimation juice into him or something whoa Okay, I realize there's only one extra path to clear, so might as well get it over with. Might as well. Here we go. All open now. Go anywhere down here. Uh, what is that for? Uh, that is the sauerkraut, yeah. Okay. Um... I think I do need more simple arm parts than something else, but I'll, I'll check it out in a, in a minute. Uh, okay, I have a zombie now. I want to know, I want to see what can I do with it, if anything, because I mean, there's many things that I can't do yet. Or at least I think I can't do. And I didn't even burn the other corpse yet, so hang on. Give me a, give me a minute. Like that. At some point, I'm quite sure that's all I'm going to be doing. I'm just going to be... I'm just going to be on a cycle of... Uh, extract everything from the body's burn. Extract everything from the body's burn. So I guess that's the point, right? Like, having lots of zombies and asking the zombies to keep taking the wood. Asking the zombies to go collect stone... Things like that. Now, also, I can grab the skulls. I can go up to the dungeon area, and apparently I can make something. I can put a thing on the floor, and then it makes so that my dungeon has quality or something. Okay, skulls in the walls. Right, one there. Cool. Now I have the quality of one. Nice. Let's talk to Gunter again, now that I found the zombie. Might as well talk to him again, maybe he has something new to tell me. No. Some kind of powder. Don't remember exactly which one. Second ingredient's blood. Sure. Okay, I'm gonna leave this body here until I get more of that. It doesn't, it doesn't matter if it decays or not, it's gonna get burned. Now, we put the zombie in the table. And we add. Yes, that's not the that's not the way. Maybe I can add the two brains into the zombie and make it like super smart. Work efficiency twelve. Right. I. I don't know. Maybe there's something I can craft now here. 
Yeah, there we go, the resurrection table. Okay. We can do that. And then I need to craft this as well. Stone the corpse act. Okay, so the they don't use that because there is no way to put one over there. That's okay, fair. Okay, here we go. Um oh I can literally place wherever I like. That's cool. Uh we'll keep this area clean for the regular mortician stuff, and I'll use this area for the resurrect. Alright, so I'm gonna assume zombie goes here. Not there. But I can I can like change the zombie itself too. For some reason. I I don't, know, I don't know what happens if I do, like, there's work efficiency, whatever that means. What if I extracted the blood? Nothing really. Work efficiency, 12%. I don't know exactly. What if I have no skulls whatsoever? Would that increase your efficiency? That being the case, which one? You know? Which one? Take the brain and take the heart out. Please don't butcher the body. Just one time. You did it anyways. I can put it in the autopsy table, but that's it. Let me get this. Oh, maybe if I leave it here, then I go there. Now there is a body. Okay, I'm very curious. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know. What do I do with you? Are you just decoration? Okay, um, all right, I'm gonna stop here, and once I figured it out, something, I'll, I'll, I'll come back to recording. Okay, not that, it, not that it matters too much, but I did finally get enough grips to squeeze uh, some wine, so I'm gonna show you that too. Um, or whatever it's worth. That's one. Another one, please. That go. That makes me two pails of grape juice. Let's get another one. I just need that many more. Anyway, and then with two pails of grape juice, this quality. Wait, 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 wait. There is a fifty percent chance of. Fifty percent chance of crafting a higher quality one. Whoa, that is kind of crazy. Yeah. Okay. So if I want to get a, an assured one, I need one of super high quality. Oh, and there is never an assured way of getting a super high quality one. Ah. Uh, well, that's the best I can do, so let's do that one. Okay, now it does its thing by itself. Okay, and the fruits of our labor resulted in... Wait, is that 20 of them? There's like 20? That's how many you made? You made 20 silver quality. Cool. Okay, I thought it was one. Yeah, yeah I, I saw like just one icon. I thought this was going to be one of those cases that... For some reason, they don't stack, but no, it's not that at all. We have, we have 20 silver quality red wine. That's awesome. All right, I'm happy with this. Okay, let's go back to body crafting and whatever. All right, body has arrived. It's now time to know. Now we'll know. So, put it in there. Okay, so it needs to be like a fresh body. It cannot be something that is already a zombie. Then there's a problem. I don't know how to reanimate this. Right? Yeah. Oh, I need faith for that. 
That kind of puts a wrench into my plans, you know? Yeah, that kind of puts a wrench into my plans. Today is Sermon Day, but that doesn't help. So, okay, uh, now I know. Now I know. Ay, 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 ay. The, the last thing I'm gonna show is a zombie getting out. That's gonna be the last footage of th this video. If my name isn't Josh Smith, and it isn't. Okay, we do can enter directly on the level two, so that's pretty good. It seems that what I broke here the other time stays broken, so there's no point in, I don't know, coming back or whatever, right? No point in, like, repeating a, a floor, I don't think, unless the monsters respawn. If the monsters do respawn, then that, that, exp that, that would be one reason, I guess. Uh, did I drop a potion yet? Nope. I didn't bring any potions, because I figured I might not need them. Maybe it was a mistake. We'll see. So apparently for me to find bloody nails, I need to find Iron Maidens. And Iron Maidens apparently are not infinite, they don't respawn, it's, it's just a thing. So if I don't complete the quest as soon as I get the bloody nails, then nothing happens. Question is, what uh, what is the punishment for, for dying? Because I died once for free. That much I know. Died once because the game dictates that the player has to die. But what is the punishment for like constant, constant dying? Oh, uh, what? What are these? Got something. I got something called death powder. I have an impression that that might be important. Yeah. Um. I'm considering just letting my guy die and see what happens. Now, now I understand why there's like a teleportation stone. Yeah. So that I don't. But okay, what if I if I die, I lose all of this, right? That's what I'm thinking. Ooh, okay. There's a powder that I can't get. That thing is walking towards me. It's paused. Okay, sure, regular wood. We'll save all the rest of the powder, I guess. Alright, here we go. Alright. Now we're gonna find out what's up. If anything. Yeah, sure. What is the price? Oh, I get to die for free? Okay, I get to die for free. Okay, that's good news. Good news, there's no there's no consequences to my actions. I am now and forever will be invincible. Okay, going up the path, New Horizons. Sign. I wonder how many logs I can chop from this big tree if only I never got tired and I was super strong. Right. Oh, so it's like zombie chopping spot, I guess. Forest near the river. Okay. Ooh, is it already connected for me? Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. So, here? Am, am I beyond this point? Maybe. I don't know where I am now. Oh yeah, there we go. I'm beyond forest near the river, so there's more. A lot more. <laughs> like a whole lot more. I don't know, maybe coming here is what gives me the progress that I'm looking for. What is this? Fine. Let's doesn't matter. Let's let's figure it out. Okay, what is this? Cabin in the woods. <laughs> okay, porter station, right. Stone cutter, stone stockpile, iron stockpile. Okay, fair enough. I get it now. The the, the area in the woods is... Ooh. Build a marble quarry. Ah. Oh. So, the area near the woods would be my zombie playground. And, okay, stone. Cool, 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 cool. That's all easy. 
always easy to do. Then I guess we have all of those, all this swampy area around here to explore at some point. All right, lovely. I, I like this. I just have to get the one thing that seems to be as elusive as anything ever. Ooh, bats. Ooh, bats. I'm just dodge, bob and weave, bob and weave. Weave one day, bob. There we go. I wonder if they're gonna be like a threat to my zombies, and that's that's the, that's what's gonna happen, right? We're gonna have zombies going about. Zombies never get tired, so they just keep working and working and working. And then what's gonna happen is those things are gonna start attacking my zombies, and then I'm gonna have to find a, either make more zombies or find a way to heal my zombies. At least that's what I imagine. All right, I legitimately almost forgot that the guy, the 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 rogue, the you know the dude Meister was about to, um, you know, about to do to go, ah, oh, no, but, uh, wait, no, I have it, I have it, no, I have it, no. it's not time yet, no, uh -huh. okie dokie, and just like that, I shall deploy the bees. Bees have been deployed. And now every so often, honey, honey, honey. Mm -hmm. Delicious. All right, tomorrow, zombie raising day. All I need, all I need is one fresh body. One fresh body and zombie juice, which I do. The game graciously gave me, graciously gave me, Um, three jo <laughs> three zombie juice, yes. Three zombie Zeus. Well, here we are. Today's the day. A very quiet and uh, foggy morning. Perfect for raising the dead. I would certainly play the Scooby Doo and Zombie Island theme for when the dead are raising if I could, but I do not want to get copyrighted. But pretend in your heads, actually go open a second tab, go look for that theme and start playing as soon as I start working on the on the body. Just 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 leave it in there. Keep it in the back of your heads. Well, we have acceleration powder. I don't know if that's gonna do anything, but I think that may be something I can place in the zombie. Or maybe I need all of those ingredients to create the zombie juice itself. Anyway, I have a corpse right there. Here we go. Ooh, but I don't have the the faith. Do I? No, I gotta take the faith too. God damn it. Okay, here we go. It's not exactly a quality body, but it's completely fine. Here we go. Cannot resurrect body is rotten? Hmm. Okay, here we go, here we go. Alright, it's- I've been waiting here for the donkey to appear with the new fresh body. Let's not waste a single second, not one single second. This body needs to be the freshest there is. 100% quality, yes. Here we go. Quality, quality body. And... Resurrect. Rise! <gasps> it's not alive! Not alive! Um. Okay, that is cool. I have a, another one of you. Now, hmm. Hmm. I, th I have an idea. I can insert things. Well, none of these, obviously. Uh, just big body. Work efficiency, 80%. I wonder. Um, now, um, 
I don't know exactly what to do with this. I have an, an inclination of what I could do. Um, maybe it's just simply missing its place. If I just take the body towards the zombie porter, eh? Take it to the zombie porter. And... Uh, I, it's going to auto-magically start doing stuff and things. Auto-magically. Watch, just watch. Watch as everything unfolds before your very own eyes. The earth... ...ought to eat uh, or something like that, I don't know. Here we go, here we go. Place him in there. Put. Ooh, look at look at this guy. Look at this guy. Ooh, look how look how cute. Okay, now now what? Cabin in the woods. Okay, ca cargo. Pick up zombie. Okay, so items to transport. He can transport all of the stuff. Okay, and. Um, right piece of marble. Pull. Um, okay, I have a question now. It, let's say I go over here and I mine some coal myself. There we go, I have coal. Now you should go like all the give me the coal bars, Brr. and then you know things should just work out by themselves. All right, uh, never mind. Just can I just drop this maybe? No. Um. Build. Ah. Or mine left or mine right. I see. I see. So, essentially what you're telling me is this or this. And then I can... Sure. Make a marble quarry right now. Okay, here we go. Let's see what happens. My dogs are going insane in the background. They, they know it's about to happen. I'm about, I'm about to win. Just watch me win. About to win. Uh, maybe, may, maybe not. Um, uh, wedge? What wedge? Wedge. Pickaxe, zombie mine on the left, zombie mine on the right. I will give my own pickaxe to the cause. Go. On the right. Yes. Are you... You're gonna go there? He won't go there. Uh... I... Am I not? Oh, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I, oh, I take you, and I place you here. <gasps> here we go. <gasps> oh, he's doing stuff. Oh, he's doing stuff. He's doing stuff. That's cool. Okay, okay, okay. I get it. I get it. So I need one zombie per place. Then one zombie mine stuff. One zombie delivers stuff. And I'm assuming I can. Place porters all over the place, and then those would be like my collection stashes. Okay, all right. Zombie is doing stuff. I somehow thought that maybe I would just see them like walking all about, like you know, going, brrr, you know, shambling all over the place. It's a lot less. It's a lot more. Hmm. It, it was a lot more. It was a lot less fanfare. Than I thought was gonna happen. I thought it was gonna be like, you raise your fuss, zombie. Achievement, necromancer. 
fucking evil music starts to play. Uh, I, I don't know, a voice appears in my head and goes like, You have uh, dabbled in the dark arts, and now there's no turning back. No, some, no, no, so I don't, anything. But I guess it's, that's not that kind of game. Oh, I, I'm still happy, we'll see what happens. There's one more thing I need to do, it happens tomorrow. I am going to complete the the rogue dude quest, and I'm gonna get myself a meat stamp, so we can start selling <clears throat> meat. Don't ask where the meat comes from. Okay, I have embalmed the scorp in some capacity. I. We extracted the blood, the fat, I made him into a proper... into a proper guy. And now, would this increase his efficiency in any way, I wonder? Work efficiency, 15%, because he is nice and trim and lean or something. Which means I can probably do the same to this guy. Oops. Yeah, but I kind of butchered him a little bit, so yeah. Well, I guess he will, he will be stuck at 12% no matter what. Burn, I have three zombies now. I can probably kick this one to the other place. Anyway, um, yeah, uh, honestly, I already recorded it enough. This video is already going to be extremely long. So, in any case, uh, we have now zombies. We have uh, production being done while we're not even awake now due to the zombies. And we're just going to find uh, a way to, like routed them properly and then we are all good um well in any case uh i hope you've been enjoying this this is quite possibly a game that i i didn't really expect to be this fun at least it's fun for me and i would love continue playing it for you if you if you so wish to watch in any case uh do consider liking and subscribing it is the bread and butter of the channel it helps a ton. Uh, leave me a nice comment down below. Every interaction you give makes so that the YouTube algorithm likes me more. Hopefully. Uh, I do have a join button if you feel so inclined to help the channel even above and beyond. Uh, you get channel badges, emotes, and you help the channel to keep going even further. Uh, there is a Discord server now. You can join. It's completely free. Just hop in, post memes, hang out. It's all good. Uh, just follow the rules, you'll be fine. In any case, thank you so much. Hopefully, I'll be seeing you beautiful you in the next one. Bye-bye. Yeah, I almost forgot. Bucket of blood and nails. Silly me. Silly me. And now... Ahaha, I've been waiting for this moment for so long. And now everything is ready. You be the first to witness his summoning. Actually, got a lot of stuff to do. Stay or you shall be punished. Okay, fine. Auto Chiquino Aperino. Ooh. Summon a chicken. Dot dot dot. Is that. Uh, is this what's supposed to happen? No, something went wrong. It seems like a lot of things are going wrong. Silence! I need to add a note to my endless notebook. Kill the scroll vendor. The miserable bastard, he told me he made an exact copy of the page I needed from the book. Seems like I need to get the original book. Do you know anybody from the university? I know a guy, astrologer. I think he used to work there. What a happy coincidence. Seems you are my good luck charm. Uh, I should have cut off your hand and start carrying it around. I'm kidding. Get astrologer to bring you the Necronomicon from the university library. And I'll owe you big. Sure thing. Oh, can I not keep the, kitchen, the, the chicken? Well, I'll just take a stamp. It's fine. Give me the royal stamp and a town pass. Why not? There we go. Now I can sell dubious meat. <laughs>